I'm on, I'm on TV. Valley Fest started about, actually it started about two and a half years ago, but the first one actually was last year. And uh, Dr. Pickett at the chamber, you know, he's the director, and we were in a meeting and uh, he said, we need to have some kind of festival to all the people into our town. And we all agreed, and uh, that's kind of how the birth of Valley Fest began. Uh, my name's Donna Frost, and uh, my band, The Bunnies, uh, we, we have we have different configurations of this band, but um, Tony, my brother Tony Frost, and Jeff Allen, the guitarist, and Tony, the drummer, and I, we've been playing together for about 30 years, off and on, in different bands. Brian O'Connor, our bass player, he just joined us a few months ago. Uh, we wear several hats. We do uh, bunny shows, which are rock and roll shows, shows like today, uh, with my solo music. I'm a touring singer-songwriter. I do a lot of acoustic gigs. I go all over the country promoting my albums and stuff. You know, I'm a, I've got three CDs and working on my fourth. Uh, and then I have, we have a rockabilly project, all sorts of things. So uh, so we do a lot of things and uh, I was happy to get invited back here today because we were here last year and uh, in fact we've been invited back next year. I noticed there's more people here this year. Uh, there's a lot. The covered stage, that's good. Uh, it's been advertised really well. Uh, it's a very nice event you can bring your family to. Uh, it's very well run. All the people involved have a joy to work with. I've developed good relationships with everybody. I think everybody needs to come out and support this because live music, support the arts. Something you bring your kid. Listen, I mean, you know, we were been rocking out. Now you got this great bluegrass music going on now. So much variety. I can't say enough good things about how it is. We love being here. I want to say thank you to everybody involved at Valley Fest for a wonderful event, for having us back every year. Um, it's a first class operation. Everybody's great. What a joy to be here. Thank you so much. Keep on keeping on. We came to Valley Fest uh, last year and that was our first time and we thought it was great because it's kind of an event where everyone in the town comes together and I wish there was more things like that going on around England because it's really nice. It is an absolute pleasure to be here once again. Um, we were here last year and we had such a fantastic time but it's just the two of us today isn't it? Yeah, we've Just got a, yeah, a couple of other band members, but they've uh, they've all gone off on vacation, haven't they? Yeah. One of them's gone to New York, one of them's gone back to England, um, so they kind of escaped their duty today. So we're doing some acoustic stuff for you, which we like doing too, don't we? I love it, don't we? We're going to do a song of ours called London Town.
got this feeling now. I got this feeling now. I got this feeling now. Got this feeling now. I got this feeling now. I got this feeling now. I got this feeling now. Now I Shining up the road I know she'll 
49 of the 50 states, um, but I'm, I'm still yet to sing in Hawaii. I prefer the Christian stuff, to be honest with you. Just, I, that's what I grew up singing. My dad's a pastor, and and uh, it's it's my comfort zone. When I sing country music, I enjoy country music. I just, I, I feel like it's more about me, if that makes sense. When I'm singing Christian music, it's not about me. It's not even, it's not even about whether I do well or not. It's just about, you know, the fact that you're doing music to glorify God, and if you're bringing glory to God, people love that, you know? At least people who want to bring honor to God, so it makes it a lot easier. <laughs> it's a lot less stressful, you know what I'm saying? And then I'm also just, I just now launched this big network for uh, musicians. A lot of times, there's not a real avenue for musicians to hook up. Like, you hear a band behind us, they met probably at school or something like that, but what about the guitar player that doesn't have a buddy at school that plays drums or bass? So I put up a website called borntogig.com where musicians can just get on there and say, hey, I play this, and maybe a guitar player who doesn't have friends to play instruments can, can look up other guys his own age and say, hey, man, you know, you guys want to get it, man? Here's a patriotic song for it. I'm from the United States and 80s, late. Navy, not 80s. I'm from the Navy, not 80s. Is there any other military people out there? All right, here's for you. In the midnight hour I see Waving proudly through the night Stars and stripes she bears Are a glorious sight She represents all the years 
next year because the acts keep getting better and better. Uh, the Valley Fest uh, is incorporated, of course, in uh, 501c3 now, and they are uh, beginning to get better and more acts every year. Uh, as the growth, uh, we're right now we're in the process of expanding and buying property across the street here, the little Wagner Street, and hopefully that'll come to happen and then we'll be able to expand it. Great, absolutely great. Um, if the weather had been a little bit more cooperative, I think we would have seen a really large growth. I think it grew from last year. We don't have the numbers finished yet, but I, I know we spent more money for entertainment. We spent more money, you know, um, putting electricity in the ground for the vendors to have where they could just ac accessible electricity, just plug in, you know, and and that made it nice for them and they want to come back next year. So I really look for next year to be a lot larger than this year. So I think the third annual is going to be really nice.